for tuning in again. Right now I am going to show you how to uh, copy a template page and um, open it and create a, a page that you wanna uh, put into your device. And when, once we, when we open the template page and copy that page, it actually has um, the clear button and the home button on it already, which is really awesome because then you don't have to worry about trying to put it in. And once you go to the page, uh, you just have to hit home and it'll go back to home. I have created a lot of pages that um, don't have that. And now I'm gonna show you how to do that. It's pretty cool. So you're gonna go to menu up top. I'm in um, touch chat word power, with word power. Uh, you're gonna go to menu and you will <clears throat> then hit edit page. And then you're going to hit menu again and you're gonna hit this thing up here that says load another page. Once you hit load another page, you're gonna try to find the template. So sometimes it's labeled word power, uh, sometimes it's labeled template. Let me just give it a whirl here. No, it's not gonna work. So we're gonna scroll down and see. Uh, so we're in word power 20. So if you can see um, here, it says Word Power 20 page template. That's the one I want. So I'm gonna select that. And if you can see, uh, this one has home, it doesn't have clear. Um, I think in Word Power 25, it also has clear. For this one, we're just gonna go ahead and do this one. And I'll check out the other one actually. But uh, so you can see in the bottom left corner, there's a home button. So once you create this page, you can label it whatever you want and then link it to a button. I'll show you how to do all that. Uh, once you enter the page, when the kiddo is done, all they have to do is hit the home button and it will go back to home and you can you know keep going from there. So now we have the load another template, uh, load another page. We have to load another page. You're gonna go to menu again and then you're gonna hit uh, load another page. And that is not what I wanted to do. Okay, hold on. Ah, uh, sorry. So now what we're gonna do is not load another page. We're going to import or copy page. So we're gonna hit this right here. Then you're gonna hit duplicate this page. And we are going to name the page. So uh, this one I want to call church friends because my, uh, my client wants to talk about church friends at school when he is at school. So that's what we're gonna name this one. And there we go. Uh, then we're gonna hit save. And then you can see up at the top, it says in the words red, it says church friends. So that is the name of the page. So now what we're going to do is link um, this new page to a button. So what I'm gonna do is hit done for now. Okay. And I'm gonna go back to the home page. So it's church friends. So what I'm gonna do is hit people. Oh, this is the home page, sorry. I'm gonna go into people. And then do you see how there's a, uh, there are four blank, white blank uh, buttons there. So I'm gonna make one of these white blank buttons my church friends button. So now I'm gonna go back and hit menu and I'm gonna hit edit page again. And I'm just gonna select, uh, I'll just put it next to the one that says friend. So you can see friend way on the right there since we're doing church friends. And we're going to edit this button and then you can label it, you know, what we're gonna label the, I mean, what we already labeled the page, church friends. Okay. Uh, if you want the button to say church friends, 
uh, you can. I usually don't when it's a page linker, when it links to another page, page linker. I just made that term up. So I'm just going to take the button message away. And then I'm going to select an image. Um, I don't know which one, what are we going to do? I'm going to come up here. I can search for church friends and probably doesn't like that. Nope. So what if I just do church, I guess? I don't know. Let's see what we want to do. Hmm. Uh, it'd be really nice if there were two friends in front of a church or something, but I don't see that. Uh, let me just see what we do for friends. I don't know if I want to put church or friends picture. <laughs> so these the friends look similar to the other one next to it, next to it. Uh, let me just go back with the picture of the church and then I'll, I'll still, it's already, la it's labeled, sorry, church friends. So I think we'll get the idea here. Um, we can just do this one. All right. So we have the button label, church friends, we have the picture. And so we're going to come all the way down here and we are going to uh, add, we're actually going to take the message away. I don't, I don't want it to say church friends. I want to, when you select it to go in there not say anything and then, and then click on the friends. So I'm going to go to button actions again. I'm going to hit add because we need to navigate to the page that we made for church friends. So we're gonna come all the way down here to navigate. And then I should be able to just click, there it is, C-H-U and church friends comes right up. That's the page we made. We're gonna hit no animation. Okay, so now when we hit this button, that's where it should go. So I'm gonna hit save, okay. Now you can see our church friends picture and then you can see uh, the arrow go on the top right pointing to the right, which means it's linking to a page. So it should be our page. I'm going to hit done to get out of edit mode and then I'm going to hit church friends. Boom. There's our page. So now we can um, put a church friend in there. I, I don't have any pictures, but we can just... So you can edit the button and then you could put, uh, just put somebody's name, Peter, <laughs> I don't know. And then if you wanted to put Peter's picture, you could put import photo if you had it, or you could just choose a guy that looks like Peter. And I don't really know who Peter is because we're just making this up. And let's put boy. See what happens. Ah, this guy's always always cute. All right, let's say this is Peter. Um, it's not, but we're gonna use him. <laughs> and there's Peter. So then we're done. And so it should say Peter. Yep. Yeah. All right. So then if we go back, just to show you, here we are at our home page. We're going to go to people, we're going to go to church friends, and we're going to hit Peter. Peter. And then we want to go back home, so we're going to hit the home button that was um, already in the template, which is super convenient. All right, that is it for this lesson. Guys, let me know what you think. Uh, tell me what else you need to know. If I don't know the answer, I can try to find it for you. All right, thank you so much. Take care. Bye-bye.